Hello and welcome to Reassembly. Today's tutorial will be part one of a two-part series explaining the three easiest ways to unlock all your parts in one ship. So essentially, as you can see right here, I've built a ship that uses parts from the crystalline, the terrans, the farmers, the bees, everyone basically. And this really shouldn't be able to happen unless you follow one of these three different ways to get all your parts into your build. So today I'll be showing you the first way, and it's the first way I ever did it. And so essentially what you're going to want to do is open up reassembly and go ahead and go to your start menu and open up a new spiky plant. Okay, if you do not have spiky plant unlocked, uh, or if you don't have flies unlocked, or borgs unlocked, or so forth, um, what you're going to want to do, and you also need contestant unlocked for this, is watch my previous tutorial, which will explain how to unlock these factions. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up a spiky plant faction, and what we're basically going to do is build a ugly ship with every part in the non-contestant game on it and then import it into the contestants so that way you can pull parts off of it. So what you're going to want to do is open up a new pallet and as you can see here we don't have everything unlocked yet so go ahead and unlock everything. Also in my previous tutorial I showed you guys how to unlock everything pretty much instantly by going into a wormhole that was worth way too much. So for this, I would recommend doing that. If you want to grind through every faction um, before you complete this, then be my guest, but I would severely recommend doing this. It saves a lot of time and frustration. So just go ahead, fly into your wormhole, and I will skip through this part. All right, and now that I've gone through the wormhole, this will allow me to upgrade and unlock everything. So go ahead and unlock everything in this faction. Not saying much, but there you go. Now go back to your fleet. Go ahead and either create a new ship or edit one. And what you're gonna wanna do is put one of every block onto the ship. It is really that simple. Um, and you will get a very ugly ship, but it will help you later on, trust me. So, basically what we're doing is, uh, the contestant faction has the Terrans, the Farmers, the Bees, and the Sentinels in it. And these factions are all unlockable by default in your palette. So what you're trying to do is you're trying to get all of the parts that are not unlockable in the contestant faction. So that would be things such as the spiky plants, the flies, the borgs, the reds, the tinkerels, and the crystalline. So now I'm just gonna move on these last few. Almost done. And there we have it. A beautiful ship. So what you're going to want to do is export this beautiful ship, and exit, and I'll just save it, why not? Alright, so now you're going to want to save and quit, and open back up, and I'm going to clear my slot, you don't have to, but it's what I'm going to do. So now what you're going to want to do is open up a file explorer, and you will find that ship that you exported either in your desktop or your downloads, wherever you exported it to. So go ahead and open it up. And you will see this code. So this may look scary to you, this may not. Uh, but what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take this number right here. And you're going to want to write 700 and faction equals 7. All right. So once you've done that, go ahead and save and close it out. And we'll go back to reassembly and we'll open up a new flies faction.
So what you're going to want to do now is either open up a new fly or create a new one. I'm going to create a new one. And you're going to want to import that thorn. Alright, so there you have it. Doesn't look too great, but there it is. So now go ahead and stick all of the fly parts on it. And there aren't any other parts to unlock. You actually didn't need to go to the wormhole. There you go. That's it. And now, same deal. Export. Exit. Save, I guess. And we'll go ahead and open that up. All right. So now what you're going to want to do is open up the new one. You can tell because it costs more and because you will see some parts on there that start with 700. There you go. So go ahead and open that up, edit it, and instead of 700, you're going to want to change that number to 6,000. And faction equals 7 is actually going to be faction equals 6. Now go ahead and save this. Close it out again, and we'll go back. You can keep the flies if you really want to, but um, I'm also going to delete that. And I'm going to start up a new org. So, I'm just going to go ahead and launch this. I'm going to actually check this time to see if there are parts to unlock. Uh, there are. And I do not start with enough money. All right. So, off to the wormhole. Alright, and now that you've made it to the wormhole, go ahead and buy everything. Alright, now you don't have to do all these factions if you don't want. I'm just doing them all to show you guys how to get every part in the game, but you can also just build uh, these ships with the parts that you think you will commonly be using. So, same deal, go ahead and import your latest thorn. And start throwing lasers on it and everything else. All right, so basically we're gonna keep repeating this process with every faction in the game, uh, except for the ones that are included in the contestant faction. Note that some of these lasers are very similar, so, Always look over them to see the differences. And also their drone launchers are probably the best in the game in my opinion. Go ahead and export this. And why not? Go ahead and exit again. And you know the drill. Go ahead and open it up. So our latest thorn right here at 6,000. Go ahead and change that 6,000 to 300. And the faction should be, guess what, three. All right, so now go ahead, save that again. And open up a new reds. Give me a second, there we go. All right, go ahead and open up a new reds faction. And go and find a wormhole. All right, and I made it to the wormhole, so as soon as I respawn, go ahead and unlock everything else again. All right, there we go. Thrusters. This Tempest is actually really good as well. All right, so now go ahead and go back to your fleet, create a new ship, and import your latest thorn. All right, so go ahead and slap one of everything on it again all right and there we go and now you're gonna want to export this and do the same thing all over again let's go ahead and save and quit start up a new faction all right so now back to your desktop new thorn and in here you're gonna want to change 300 to 400 and faction three to faction six. I'm just kidding. It's faction four All right, so now that you have done that save again close it out desktop back over there and Go ahead and create yourself a new tinkerel faction There you go
Alright. So now, I'm going to wait for the wormholes to generate. You can always tell in the top left up there when all the wormholes are done generating. And pick one that's pretty close, it's usually easiest. Alright. Something to keep in mind with uh, the Tinkrell is they actually have the best shields in the game and also some of the worst armor and they have some other pretty great stuff. So go ahead and um, buy everything again. Their drone launchers, especially this one, is amazing. And these gun modifiers are just wonderful. They're the best part of this game in my opinion. So now that we've got that, you know the drill, go ahead and import again. And go ahead and start throwing everything on there. Alright, and there we go. And export again. And now go ahead and open back up desktop. Alright, so your last faction is set that to 11,000 and then set this faction to 11. Alright, save and I'm just gonna skip through this. Alright, now go ahead and open up the last one and change 11,000 to 800 and actually you're gonna want to change the whole thing. So note this part right here. This is the coordinates for that command module. You're gonna to want to copy that and just paste it at the top. Now, take this line of code out of the description and paste it in between the uh, two brackets right here and here. There you go. And now take that number you saved and replace this. There you go. Now save that, close it again, close that, and start up a new contestant faction. Now, this new contestant faction, when I get out of tutorial mode, has the ability to get everything in the game other than what you just put on that ship. So you can go ahead and buy whatever you want here and then whenever you create a new ship go ahead and import your newest thorn. This one. Alright, so now what you do is you find your command module which for me is here and you can build your ship. So you can start building your ship off of this. And whenever you want a part that's not in your pallet, just drag it off of this and you can always clone it. And that is how that is the first way of unlocking every part in the game. If you would like to find out two other ways of unlocking everything in the game, I will show you that in the part two of this series. Thank you for watching, be sure to like and subscribe to get back to the basics.